And that is how your morning is sounding today. It's Friday. This is the TGIF edition of the Uprising. Thank God it's Friday. Uh, the weekend is upon us. Felix Stoppe, Jeb Zwanekaya Zadla, and you, the most important part of the show. Boy, oh boy, am I excited about the third and final hour. This is the reality hour. And our reality today is we're talking to someone who is, let's just say, um, a subject of many, many, many men's uh, fantasies. Ah, <laughs> 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 uh, yes. KZN's own Durban Born Han, who is a pioneer. Uh, who would have thought we could see the streets of Durban? Uh, you can bump into a world renowned porn star. Yes, I said it. Porn star. And she's here in studio with us, uh, having a heart-to-heart -heart check. So we're going to unpack things. We're going to ask things. It's going to be uncomfortable. It's going to be cringeworthy. It's going to be very exciting. Uh, this is a rebellion in radio. It's the uprising on Kagasi FM. I'm I have never in my life seen Felix this excited. There's been so many moments that we've shared where he's excited. It is never, ever reach this level so <laughs> oh man um uh, colin fega uh, is a south african adult uh, content model uh, she's here in the studio with us um yeah uh, trust me your partner knows colin fega <laughs> i know you're traveling in the car right now together you're like no he didn't yeah you know he, your partner knows her <laughs> i see him pretending he doesn't he does <laughs> Go to his search history. <laughs> so, yeah. Good morning, Tony. Welcome to Kagasi FM. I'm Gabong. I'm Unjan. Yeah, like cool. Yeah. Yes, we are here. And you, and you think, sorry, I'm, I'm you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> we are Pila and Umos. Yeah, <laughs> but yes, yes. Gabong. <laughs> <laughs> sorry, no. Oh, oh, no, <laughs> in, wait. <laughs> Guys, obviously, for, for research, uh, I've had wow. to also go into our candy actually. You know, in the corner. Just for research. For this, for this interview. So we sp <laughs> have spent a, a bit of time, like nine hours, like just making sure Oguti. <laughs> you know what you're talking about. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, la, la. <laughs> uh, we are excited to have you on the show. So we're going to be asking you um, a, a certain question. So if you are traveling with a baby or a child or someone who's uh, uh, not of age just yet, please uh, use your discretion because this is adult content. So they say you are an adult uh, content. content model. No, porn star. I prefer porn star. Yeah, okay. You're a porn star. Yeah, well. Colin Fega, uh, am I at liberty to ask, like, were you from in Durban? Yes? Um, yeah. I'm going to Pain Dan. Yeah, Pain Dan. Thank God. That is so close to where I live. Uh, I'm also from Pain Dan. <laughs> okay. Yeah. No, but I'm very married, so I... Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just before lunch. Yeah, I know. Eh? <laughs> <laughs> but what I'm managing for was, so how did it all start for you? How did you become a porn star? South Africa doesn't have a porn star. And we'll come well uh, from the neck of our woods. How did you, how did you start? I call on, uh, uh, what do you mean? They, they hide their identity. It's got okay. a thing. So you wouldn't know because... Again, for my visa, I'm Yeah. Yeah. Far from, you know, like a stage name. So, yeah. So, when I was in the to get into the industry and use Ikama, I'm guessing with Ikama, a yeah. name that everyone knows you by. Yeah. Um, so, we are born to win. Yeah. So, so why that, um, that, that confidence to say, Angizukasha behind the stage name? <laughs> It just, honestly, uh, I just couldn't find something that relates to me or any name that relates to me. So just like, I, as Lim is a chin. But it's kind of like a genre, like you're a porn Why do you say that? Hmm, you're not a little bit. No, you know how it started? It started with um, OnlyFans. On Twitter, they liked our videos. I thought, whatever you're doing on OnlyFans, videos of yourself touching yourself, mm. and you know, I was like, yo, so this is out. So everyone has seen everything already. Yeah, yeah but already. Yeah, but. So uh, I wanted to take like another route. Yeah, but. And, and the email was like, Ugh, 
let me just um verify my accounts on the well known porn sites mm -hmm. on hub na, na X videos and see where this gets me because email on OnlyFans was pretty good. The risk was just like okay. Mm. Yeah, but uh see a build. So quick only fans because na kona a gazing in a con. Gwen's one. We try in love the pen. Um yeah, you do almost everything. You post pictures of your private parts. Private parts. Mm -hmm. Anything, you play with yourself, anything. More to play with yourself, which we would see. Yeah, sex toys, okay. you can play touch yourself. Um, Mina, I did have a guy that I'm working with, Diablo Shama clips, you know. Ninzin. Ninzu Kans. Sends with Kans. Okay. No Ming Tinda or Yabo Shama clips, then I sell the longer versions on the DM. Ah. It's ya boni legu three minutes bambala. So most of them to the swans and I like near span is this and and no, Tandani. No, we were dating. Oh, you were dating. Yeah. Okay. So and then started suddenly you cooler le see some leaky information yeah. and then you put it out there. Na na with Kalonzi Mali and Bell. Yeah. So uh, and then yeah, oh take us on a journey and then what happened after that? What happened after the? Usui fagi di la pa na se kala sengeni Mali manje. Oh no! It feels. <sighs> Because you always hear stories, you could see how many, um, how much people make on these platforms, mm -hmm. and it's what's going on here. But it's a, a lot of work, honestly. Content creation, basically, it's a lot of work. Mm. I, and then when it comes to fucking, hi, guys, a chance, we fuck for hours. But and then you know, getting good see, angles, color pants, cards. Getting good angles, facial expressions. Yonkin do must be proper. And what is the most money you've made from selling sexual content on, on online? Um, two fifty. Two hundred fifty thousand. Yeah. <gasps> Jeez. Come tevazo. That's yeah. a lot of money. <laughs> <laughs> you just need to know, know the right platform to actually sell your content. Mm. Yeah, well. So, I mean, if you know, you know, the the cringeworthy part. So, if you like, for you know, 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 you um, be a model, yabonje, do exotic stuff, yabong show lingerie, and bang veiling posty eat on began on my previous account on Instagram, yabo. Okay. So, and then when this girl approached me about OnlyFans, it it, it, it looked so far fetched, yabo. And then when I started making money out of OnlyFans, I was like, hi, but so if I can go a mile longer, yeah. I can make more. So, yeah, that's as in, at the end of the day, God, I'm going to die. She's in a Bible. Yeah. You're a man. You're a man. You're a man. Yeah, well. So, so uh, um, now, in the flow, guys, like, Uma um, Wenziwa, a content for porn, correct? Mm -hmm. How many people are there in the room? Uh, Six, seven. Six, seven? Yeah. Oh, cameramen. But till I can't name his wife because when I'm born, I'm going to shoot you. Shandy, I'm going to be No, I mean, uh, I'm going lucky because I, I work with people who are passionate about their work, who love uh, shooting videos yeah. and whatnot. So for them, Nako, it's an experience. They've never shot porn. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bro? So it's just like I so one good to send in Jan, but now we need the perfect angles, and Abafana they watch porn. Yeah, yeah, okay. So they know what works <laughs> for porn. Uguti, yabo. How, how many times have you had sex in one day? In one day? Yeah. Hey, man. More than two. Two people? Yeah, two people. More, more than two? Like how many? Like four or five? No, I mean like more two people. Yeah. Ex Xen one. Now, Tamba Mumun. Yes, I'm, I'm, I, I admire the one thing about you, Oli, how comfortable you are in what you have chosen to do. Yeah. Because yeah. you're an adult and you have the agency to choose exactly what you want to do when you want to do it. So that's the one thing I'd like to give you props for. 
but also you using ikamalako elpelele um ngomsebenzo wenzayo obviously that follows you that follows your family abantu bayazi ukuthi uqhamu kamuphi umndeni um bayazi ukuthi usisika sibanibani uyingane ezalwa umasibanibani so how how does that follow you how does that affect you and how does it affect your family if at all uh my family are pretty much open minded people which i'm grateful really? yeah which i'm grateful for okay yeah, well, I see cuz na corner before I took the the pawn to the ne- next level mm. I'm like this is what I want to do should I show sure? mm. because this thing is going to follow you everywhere you go yeah, yeah but are you sure na no I've always been ingane lale layo I've always done things the right way yeah, but so it was just like we trust you enough uh, we say uh, you you okay with mm, this mm. because at the end of the day if this is a huge mistake it's my mistake to make to make you know i've in a very safe place like i don't want to do mistakes if i'm taking risks i'm taking i'm a risk i got safe a safe mm, i've mm. never just like boom yeah yeah but and so far it's working for me so. but nakwana can imagine your mom ehle nabanye your mom uthi uyena kuxolo bami lo wenze iphone like so i don't know in the engifuna engifuna ukuyazila is kulo msebenzi wenzayo is sex industry this is all this profession eh kade yaqala since time immoral we we know that uh, and we know that there's a market for it. It's a yeah. multi-billion dollar industry. So people consume it. Yeah. They might not talk about it, but they do it. Yeah. And you are the one person that says, hey, you know what? I'm not going to tell you behind the curtain and say, this is okay. So basically, now, you, as a point step, are you romantically linked to someone? And how do they feel about you selling sex to other men? Yeah, I am in a relationship. Mm-hmm. Uh, for me, it's just like if we're dating, you know what I do, nanani, you okay with it, we move. Yeah, okay, Ganja, not like what you can't have a seven in the gas and seven in the one. Maybe it would be a different uh, thing if um, we see a song engine, but as Sally Song, I have my own place, mm-hmm. they have their own place, so yeah, bo. yeah. But men sebenza obviously we can't. So so, so now if usu no muntu wako ge manjine, se se nchel no muntu wako and you are having um sex. Uh, I believe as a porn star at some point you become desensitized to sex. So is it still um uh, something that you feel umo and the sex no muntu wako? Is it still sensual? Is it still or is it just erotic stuff that you do when you're on the job? No, eh men I don't yeah. uh, I don't have to be a lot of things men uh-huh. sem benzin but mingi no muntu ami I can be myself yabo nan I'm not trying to do everything correctly mm. or to look yeah, no, but if you go to the house, you can go to the house. 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 You can go to the so, um, okay. Um, I have so many questions. Jesus. <laughs> Pace yourself. Yeah. Mm. So, so, like, during... Uh, you have to maintain a certain level of professionalism. True. So, when you're filming and shooting, ne, with a stranger, and you're doing it, when you're doing climax, or, or is it unprofessional? Or, it is. Or it it is a good thing. <laughs> yeah. Uh, climax is a good thing. Yeah. At the end of the day, we are enjoying ourselves. Yeah, well, as much as we l- have to look professional or whatsoever, yeah. you have to enjoy it. Same mm. same So you're appreciate. doing what you love. Yeah. For work and getting paid yeah. for Yeah. Yes, I think Mtlampe, another another question Umuntu Oslalele might have is you're a beautiful young girl. Um, you smart. Still now, ukulumi te pilai. Yeah. You know, and um, you've you've 
achieved quite a lot of success in, in the adult entertainment industry very quickly and you're in demand. Um <laughs> jump straight into this as soon as you saw that there's an opportunity I've, to make this much money. I've always uh, tried things. I've tried getting into um, acting. I've always wanted to be in the inter- entertainment industry. Yeah. <laughs> so, uh, I was doing uh, poetry. Mm-hmm. Then I was like, oh, I love acting. I tried a few auditions here and there. Um, and I got picked. We actually shot, but I got paid for it. And like, I got a lag and 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 Cause I've worked at restaurants, I've worked at a, a club. Kona Ishan this big day so kono chala la NPN and again I've mm-hmm. also worked there. Is there anything that would make you quit the industry? Menga vela ito ba noma umuntu menga menga kamuga ne samba. Is there is there any amount of money or any opportunity that would make you say okay, uh, pens this down, is this is it, it's over. Um. For now, no. Okay. Because the thing is, I love what I, I'm, I'm doing, honestly. And because sure. okay. now I don't want to resent anyone or any situations. So, so, in midlife, midlife crisis. Exactly. <laughs> no. Uh, okay. So, um, um, do you have like a club of other girls that are that that that, that are doing the same thing that you? Uh, I know you've moved to Johannesburg. Yeah. So it, you feel a good slap and there's more business in Johannesburg than there is here. Yeah. And there is. Uh, do you have uh, collaborations I, with other girls that do the yeah, same thing? Yeah, true. I have collaborations with other girls, and I don't know, just Joburg. J. I don't know. Kapef Mulegalapan. Lang as a semakaya. Oh wow wow wow. Wow. <laughs> wow. <laughs> like um like ooh, like in Joburg, sex work is normal. Okay. Yeah, well, we'll see if you are selling, you're selling. If you're well, it's just it's no, a business. It's a business. Yeah. So if you say it's oh, it's just like oh, oh wow, interesting. Okay, cool. I'm also doing the same thing, but yeah, well, I feel like I've always known you. South Africa. Welcome back. This is Gaga CFM Nguhua, where we zoom in into the life of a, a mover and a shaker. And we're talking about a mover and a shaker, South Africa's very first porn star. Oh, is she a shaker? Listen to me. <laughs> <laughs> and she's here with us uh-huh. answering very uncomfortable questions and also um, uh, giving us some cringeworthy uh, 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 behind the scenes uh, 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 knowledge of the things we've always wanted to know. Uh, I was disappointed when I asked you, good singer, how many people have you done it in one day? And you said two. I'm like, ah, no yeah, snee. No snee, we are going to two. Ah. <laughs> 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 no snee. I know. <laughs> I can take as much as if the money is good. Yeah. Yeah. It no, no, go say, oh, at least in a month, we are living. The body naturally yeah, puts you on forced leave. Wow. <laughs> so, should I just cut myself? I'm going to push. Yeah. I'm going to push. Yeah, we COVID, guys. What is the biggest, what, what size is the biggest toy you've ever inserted in yourself? I'm going to say, honestly speaking. Yeah. I'm going to say, I'm going to say, because I'm going to say, yeah. Yeah. So, normal size. Normal size. Yeah. Some of you ruler. 15 centimeters. No, that's too thin. That's actually a boot. Boot. Yeah. Um, no. You don't like thin, you like big. Yeah, I like I like long and thick. 
if it's short, it has to be thick. Is it? A bit of girth. Ah, very good. No shorts, one girl, as long as we. It's too long. All right, so we're going to ask you a, a quiz. We're going to ask you a few questions. Um, okay. We need for you to be honest. You have been honest uh, since Kalile interviewed it. I don't see why you changed now. Uh, but we need for you to answer in a bit. Okay? okay. Like, ah! Don't hey. miss a beat. Hey, hey. <laughs> okay. Uh, I, I think with this first one, it's going to be very easy. So I'm going to ease it into you, okay? Okay. Question one. You prefer the real McCoy or a sex toy? Real McCoy. Mm. Do you prefer small or extra large? Extra large. Soft or hard action? Hard action. <sighs> Do you watch porn yourself? <laughs> <laughs> like, as, as somebody in the industry, um, like us, for example, yeah. we listen to radio, Mangabe's Driver, say, whatever, no, we no, work in the industry. No, I, I, I do watch porn hey. a lot. Is it mostly, uh, like, international? How, how do you position yourself as a South African porn star? Because you're one of the first. So where mm. do you draw your inspiration from, if I can ask it like that? Um, from the states, but uh, you know, Africans do uh, eponym nant that mm. you can relate to. Okay. And stuff like that. I love that. The yeah. amateur porn. Sure. Yeah, I love it. But cool. now uh, I'm here to make money, so young kind has to be quality. Must level yeah, up. Yeah, yeah. Must level. Last question. Virginal or anal? Yes. Ah, virgin. I will. <laughs> 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 okay, so what is the most awkward thing you're getting while filming? Filming. The yeah, the funny awkward thing that you laugh about also Oh, the, the the guy came like in like three, four minutes. What you shoot? I'm like Bah, for karma. Oh, look, she's in Bao. Oh, I know. I, I think why it's hooky, and all the time it was just imagining, imagining, yeah. imagining. Yeah, bo. Yeah. I'm like, <laughs> so do you get to meet them before we start talking and talk about the shoots and the scenes and the angles? Or, but come when the woman does come on the shoes on. I know. Eh, eh. We we have to take precautions. We in jungle bars, we so when we have a we use protection and then. We do a sensor ilo see to get tested nan nan then okay. two days after. Yeah. And two days after. So look to kill Jika with what pelusa illo lum twal. For two days we tell you. Maybe it's like for sure some advice about Figel up and show you performance I and that. But four minutes is a long time, isn't it? Oh. No, it's so not okay. because that's fine. But I'm going to come in. I'm going to come in. I'm going to come in. It's not because I'm going to see figure on set. Yeah, but see a kuluma. We sometimes we smoke weed. Yeah, but and stuff just to get comfortable. Yeah, but and then we actually yeah when we actually yeah, but it's got this kuluma. Come on. Yeah. What What is the one thing that you hate in sex? One thing that I hate that you don't like. Yeah. Not coming. Are you serious? I'm saying I have to. It's a wasting minute if I don't come. So. He he. Bang. Bang. I go to get to come. What? He he. Bang. I go to come. You find some other people. Bang. I go to come. So he he. Bang. I go to come. Oh no! I've realized to go to me na get to my cool when I'm doing oral sex. Okay. Yeah, well, when you kiss my nipples and All touch right. me. Oh nga. For hours. Yeah. I'll take it because I can take it, but. Yeah. So pounding is actually not uh, into a bango guti when this wasn't a come. No, for me, I don't know with other women, but I. Saying at Lapa, I don't mean funny, feel I relax and shang at so unagi, yeah. Relax. Come out, could more than that, no more in you. No, uh, either way, because now if I'm direct, okay. do this, do this, 
missing and getting Galil. So, um, would you encourage other women to also uh, follow in your footsteps and get into no, if, uh, the sex industry? Yeah, if they are comfortable enough mm. to do so, because I'm going to mind you, conduct, so, ah, actually took an advice from. But if you are comfortable enough and you know the risk of taking this path, the good seed will always follow you no matter where you are. Mm. Yeah, bro. What is the one thing on my comba? Oh, Oti, because of uh, Mavi JJ, I've been able to achieve that. What can you do again again? Get there. Lale, lale. Na gube roof la pan. And I'm gonna decide what's gonna go in lungi senje ni kishi ni taningi ni tengo sofa makamero chama built in it's ding 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 ding. Yabo. Then I move on to the outside, thing a beer and everything else. But thank you for the yo. Yeah, ne. Thank you for the thing in moto. Yeah. <laughs> so, so <laughs> and I'm ready, Shem. I am ready. I wanted to find out um around and people being able to recognize you um in the streets <laughs> Is it is it something that you were okay with Mexico or or did it take you aback? Who could say, "Ah, I'm within. I'm within. I'm inside." No, um, uh, my uh, manager, my previous manager, could say, "Wow, I show us." I know. You know, when we first started uh, posting um, on X videos, mm. and then it hit, um, I think five five hundred k views. Yeah. Hey. Hi, yeah, yeah, yeah. And then my friends started sending me screenshots of their other mutual friends. Good day, Nina. Yeah. And I'm like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Ain't got to close up to go to get a guy. What's our scam, Gangan? That's it. But then I got used to it. Yeah. Yeah. As I, I really miss the chain with it. Yeah. So imagine you, Inj, Div. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's it's interesting to know. But now, um, we go more ya mas ekaya bangela we na we agwazo ba pili sulungi se kai fundi singa ne ba ngo kans. So uh, I, I think it adds dignity to the profession. Yeah, as soon pela ya ma looks a pili to awai muche. Yeah. And then what happened? Mm. Omuche yeah. nani? Yabo. So njengo bi sito sako se si genseli mal we agwazo bi seven sinji. No, there's a very wins Malik Pell. I know, guess so. Been the Sanjay. You sing I live on your mawaw. No, 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 for someone I'm, uh, I'm dating or yeah. seeing, yeah. you know, I enjoy it. No, so now in the sex industry, we, we, we actually spoke about the sex industry, um, uh, at length a couple of weeks ago. And we, we we began to underst- understand uh, isn't a ningi about the sex industry, about the mm. sex toys, about the pictures and moving pictures and what not, what not. So umuntu say tlambo taisu tanti emkwakeni, umuntu tlambo who is in a in a house somewhere that plies their trade in actually selling themselves to people to come buy sex and whatnot. Mm. What would you say to those people now that you know of other po- opportunities that lie behind the curtain? Um, for me, it's Daisa Miham Biaham. Yeah, that's when you know it's more productive. But if you are doing other things, like I mean, I'm, I'm streaming, I'm going live, and if people want to see, they pay, if they want to see it's like going live on Instagram or Facebook, mm. but you actually get paid for that. I, I, I feel like you need to be narrow minded. Mm. If you can sell and also go live and make money, nan nan, go and go to any comfortable now. As you're talking, I'm actually thinking about this. This is the first time I'm actually being uh, given advice by a porn star. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty you know, interesting. So, like, even if you're you're on an entertainment industry, mm-hmm. you can do acting, you can do presenting, club hosting, nan nan. Whatever it takes to make it scatele uklupega. Yeah, well. What What do you know now that you wish you had known earlier? I would say I, I can actually make money out of sex. 
mean if guys lending as your manch mm. i would have like ngabe nga break kwa umuntu one man ngathi yazi ngayidayisa le mpahla i'm a virgin pay me this amount of money this is Gaga CFM. <laughs> this is the uprising in the morning, having a heart to heart talk with South Africa's number one porn star. Colin Fega from here in the KZN here in Durban by way of Pine Town. And now um, uh, taking up residence in Johannesburg and making serious moves. And she took time to have a chat with us. Uh, this interview will be available on podcast so you can check it out. Uh, uh, thank you so much for your time, Sissy. <laughs> taking time uh, off your busy <laughs> schedule between the sheets uh, to come here and be with us i know <laughs> <laughs> you gotta show me a move I know, so. yeah, yeah listen listen if, if, <laughs> if i were to ask you to do something um just need for me now just two moves. Two moves. Two moves. Two moves. Rising. Weekly morning, 6 to 9, with Felix Longevs.